How do you plan to deal with the new tougher regulations regarding sulfur emissions in exhaust gases? Well, there aren't that many alternatives, especially for those operating in emission control areas. In a dramatic way, it is actually life or death for, for the Volvo vessels in, the, in, the, in this area. In cooperation with MAN, Alpha Laval installed a hybrid scrubber on board the Ficaria Seaways, the world's first and largest of this scale on board a ship. This scrubber is a combination of an open and a loop system. And now we have seen that in both open and closed loop, we can wash down to a level below 0.1% sulfur. So it actually has shown that it is working, being able to operate with HFO instead of MGO. Ready for a closer look? Welcome aboard Ficaria Seaways. This hybrid system works in both seawater and freshwater modes to not only effectively remove sulfur from the exhaust gases in order to comply with coming stringent regulations, but it also removes up to 80% of other particles from the exhaust gas as well. Let's start at the heart of the system. The circulation pump moves either seawater or freshwater through the system. To avoid corrosion, all pipes are made of highly durable fiberglass reinforced epoxy resin. The all essential scrubber is placed inside the funnel. When compared with its sister vessel, not yet equipped with pure socks, it's obvious the funnel on Ficaria Seaways is much larger. But that's understandable, considering pure socks cleans 200 tons of exhaust gas every hour. First, the jet scrubber cools down the exhaust gas, enabling the first sulfur reduction. Next, the gas moves on to the second stage in the main scrubber section. Here, the exhaust gas is cleaned and then leaves the funnel. Water carrying the sulfur is discharged into the sea, well within IMO regulations. In sensitive areas and many harbors, discharging system water is strictly prohibited. Here, the system switches to its freshwater mode, where water used to cleanse exhaust gases remains in a closed system, with zero environmental impact. Switching between freshwater and seawater modes is automatically controlled via GPS position or manually via the control panel. They will just push the start button and then, then it will automatically shift in between the two different modes when it has to. In freshwater mode, a small amount of caustic soda is added to the water as it circulates in a closed loop. The water is collected in the circulation tank. From here, some of the water is sent to a well-proven Alpha Laval high-speed separator for cleansing. The residue from the water is collected in sludge tanks and can be handled as the ship's normal sludge. In closed loop mode, circulated water is cooled thanks to an Alpha Laval heat exchanger. Back in the machine control room, the system is easily monitored as well as its efficiency. So far, we have uh, had a great success with the scrubbers. We have been extremely pleased with the cooperation with, with Alpha Laval. Alpha Laval is the most experienced and best prepared supplier to help the shipping industry meet the new environmental regulations. TFTS's policy is that we will never ever bring us in a situation where we can't comply with the legislation. Together with DFDS, Alpha Laval has overcome the challenges to develop a system that is in full operation today. Now we have a squabble that we are extremely proud of. Vicaria Seaways is ready for the future. The question is, are you?